Hey guys, it's Bradicus. So I just finished the um, Legacy of the Void campaign and I decided to go ahead and start a playthrough of all the original StarCraft and probably going to do the whole playthrough through uh, the campaign on StarCraft 2 too. So uh, we're going to go ahead and jump into this and uh, get started. Um, <clears throat> We'll start with boot camp. We're going to start with the tutorials and work our way all the way through all the campaigns. Welcome to Marsara, Magistrate. The equipment demonstration you requested is prepared and may be initiated at your convenience. All right, so this is just a tutorial. We're going to go ahead and jump right into it. The SCV is the cornerstone of our hostile environment construction and resource gathering operations. Roger that. In order to build a thriving colony, numerous SCVs are necessary. So I started SCVs playing StarCraft in 1998 when it was released. I was 12 years old. I am a huge fan of the StarCraft environment um, and the stories and the whole entire universe and everything. Uh, just gonna get this SCV going here. <clears throat> so yeah, so I've been playing StarCraft now for shoot 17 years uh i was 12 years old when it first came out um you know so it was very influential in my uh my childhood and my upbringing i love sci-fi so this game just totally fit into everything move these guys out shut the fuck up All right, all right, dude. I get it. So, anyways, um, yeah, uh, I played uh, Warcraft two um, when I was nine, ten years old. Uh, a family friend of ours had brought us to an internet cafe, a gaming cafe kind of thing uh, back when they existed in the United States, and. Uh, I got introduced to RTSs that way. I spent about an hour playing Warcraft 2 and totally fell in love with it. Uh, we had a very cheap PC I could play on, and um, you know, Windows 95, you know, that kind of ordeal. Um, and uh, so I totally fell in love with RTSs. And when StarCraft came out, uh, I was a huge fan. I completely loved the whole entire world and uh have been playing it ever since it's a not a daily thing i play but i definitely play at least one game of starcraft every month um starcraft 2 typically and uh will continue to do so probably for the rest of my life or as, as long as they continue uh putting out content for it so but uh you know, just to keep myself occupied and stuff like that, I decided to go ahead and do a Let's Play and, um, you know, start working on this. So these videos are going to come out. Um, I'm going to pre-record all of them and kind of get them all ready and stuff like that and release one a day, hopefully. Uh, if not, maybe once every week or twice a week or something like that. But, um, yeah, no, I love the uh, I love the story. I'm not a huge fan of the Terrans. Um, <laughs> My least favorite of all, uh, all of the races. So um, we're gonna kind of struggle through this. I uh, don't really have a whole lot of patience for playing with them, but since that's the beginning of the whole entire universe, uh, you know, we gotta we gotta play through it. But anyways, um, so I'm just going to uh, blow through these tutorials. These first, uh, I think it's. I think it's two or three, I don't know. Um, it's been quite a few years since I've played this. I think about ten uh, since I've played any uh, of the old old school StarCraft stuff. So, well, hopefully we can just kind of get this crap all out of the way here. If you hear me do that every once in a while, that's me hitting my vape. But yeah, this is... Uh, this is pretty boring here at the beginning. Come on. Yes, sir. 
There we go. All right. There we go. We can build a refinery. <clears throat> Your forces are under attack. And once he's done with his refinery, we're going to head move over my SCVs. SCVs, not SUVs, SCVs. I'm going to put all of them on there just to kind of get this through with. Almost done. So yeah, I don't uh, I don't play StarCraft competitively or anything like that. I um I just love the campaigns. Um, I uh, you know I do play a little bit of multiplayer here and there. Um, usually I save a lot of my multiplayer multiplayer play for um, games like Heroes of the Storm and uh, Hearthstone. Um, as far as StarCraft, you know, it's such a huge competitive environment. I, I just really don't enjoy it that much. But the storylines and the um, campaigns are great for me. So, this concludes the equipment demonstration. victory. There will now it's all be good and done. Reception at Marsara Base. There we go. All done. Okay. Wasteland. Adjutant Online. Good evening, Magistrate. I'll fill you in on what's been happening. Confederate traffic has increased substantially within the system due to the recent Protoss destruction of the Chow Sar colony. The Confederates have tightened security on all outlying systems, and it's likely that this colony will be locked down as well. An encrypted Confederate transmission came for you while you were at dinner. Replaying transmission. Greetings, Magistrate. I'm General Edmund Duke of the Confederate Security Forces Alpha Squadron. The Confederacy has quarantined this entire planet, and we'll proceed with a lockdown within 48 hours. You are to relocate your core colonists to the outlying wastelands. Now, I know there won't be any problems with these new arrangements. Transmission ended. I have contacted the local marshal, James Rayner. Rayner has agreed to meet your personnel en route and escort them to the new wasteland site. All right, let's get this started. Looks like we're meeting up with Jim. Commander. Of course, as we all know, is a... Uh, very influential uh, StarCraft character. Oh, the Confederates. Well, you guys don't last very long, so. There's Jim. Howdy, boys. I'm Jim Rayner, Marshal of these parts. Well, Jim, it, learns, it looks like you uh, learn how to pluck your eyebrows. Later on. <laughs> I still can't get over how he looks like he has a unibrow there. Anyways. Alright, let's get some SCVs started on these uh, minerals here. The objectives are... Barracks. Marines. Okay. This should be easy. I'm going to go ahead and move these guys out. I'm just going to blow right through this. Let's get a couple more SCVs. Take a hit off my vape. SCV, good to go, sir. All right. Should be enough for this. Let's move. Spider mines. Let's throw a couple of them out here just to protect us. Just in case. I don't think anything is going to attack us in this one, but. Sounds fun. Three for duty. Yes, sir. SCP good to go, sir. Affirmative. Alright. I read you. We get 
fifty. One more, there we go. Okay, we'll do the barracks. Reporting for duty. Yeah, maybe I'll use some other guy to build it. Yes, sir. Orders, Captain. Yes, sir. And we'll actually build another one when we get 150. Orders, Captain. Commander. Can I read you? Yep. Just so we can blow right through this. Jacked up and good to go. Give me something to shoot. Standing by. Give me something to shoot. We gotta move. Are you gonna give me orders? Oh my god, he's whacked. <laughs> I'm whacked. How oh, are you? Oh. Hard ass. Okay. All right. Come on, guys. Infantry units such as Marines can be trained at this facility. Reporting for duty. Wonderful. Watch this guy out here and see if I can get him slaughtered real fast. Oh, there we go. Cool. Victory. Okay. Backwater station. We're moving along. Receiving incoming transmission. Comlink established. Hey, what's up, man? Got your refugees tucked in nice and tight. Provide you can sidestep any more surprises from our Confederate friends and we can keep them away from those critters. They should have an easy time. Priority alert. Backwater station under attack by unknown alien organisms. Distress beacon activated at 0658. Alerting Confederate headquarters on Tarsonis. Stand by for incoming transmission. We've already received the distress beacon from Backwater, and we'll take care of it. You just sit tight. You'll be notified if there's anything we think you need to know. Damn. Listen, if we wait for Confederate reinforcements, that station's dust. I'll head out there now and do what I can. You send in some militia, and we'll save those folks. Trust me. All right, Jim. I will trust you. Glad to see you, boys. All right. Let's go ahead and knock out some SCVs. Standing by. Okay, we got 26 supply. I'm going to try not to uh, build any more supply stations. We should be able to do this with uh, what we got here. Can I read you? I should drop some spider mines just so uh, oh, yeah. get a little bit of protection. This should be good. Yes, sir. You want a 
piece of me, boy. Yeah, that's good to go, sir. Orders, Captain? Roger that. Not enough minerals. Right. Go ahead, Commander. I love this retro music. Rainer here. SCB good to go, sir. Affirmative. All right. for one more marine and then we're gonna head out I think I don't know I haven't played this in a long time I think there's a base or something up here north See. What the hell is that? Looks like the ground there is alive. Rainer here. This should be good. Street colony, old school. Rock and roll. Rainer here. This should be good. Sounds fun. Thanks for the rescue. We've been holed up in these bunkers for days hiding from the Zerg. Orders received. Rainer here. Sounds fun. Orders, Captain. Go ahead, Commander. All right. Need a light. Sounds fun. Fire bats. It's pretty sweet. Love the uh, retro look they got going on with the purple and red. This should be good. Festive Command Center. Whatever it is, it ain't natural. Burn it, boys. Long before infestors, guys. <laughs> Transmission. Marshal Rayner, by destroying the vital Confederate installation, you and your men have violated standing colonial law. As of right now, you're all under arrest. I suggest you throw down your weapons and come peaceably. Are you out of your mind? If we hadn't burned that damn factory, this entire colony could have been overrun. Maybe if you hadn't taken your sweet time in getting here. Now, I asked you nice the first time, boy. 
I didn't come here to talk with you. Now throw down them weapons. Guess you wouldn't be a confederate if you weren't a complete pain in the ass. Victory. All right, let's go ahead and move along. Ooh, cutscene. Yeah, like the music. Hey, Sarge. Why we always gotta listen to this shit for anyway? Cause I'm in charge, that's why. Yeah, vagina mouth. Oh, don't seem like no good kind of reason to me. Awesome. 90s animation is great. Some poor feathers, dog, Sarge. It's a Zerglin, Lester. Smaller type of Zerg. But he'd be out this far unless. Oh, shit. I love you, Sarge. <laughs> <laughs> 